Hello friends and welcome to another video here playing 5 minute games here on chess.com we are already facing a Sicilian defense okay let's go the dragon let's play against the dragon that's what we're doing here all right so he's already playing very fast and furious the dragon player the fast and furious dragon player let's play king b1 after queen a5 let's go for that rook c8 that's what dragon players do queen a5 rook c8 that's what he's gonna do i'm pretty sure because this is what every dragon player does and now we do have this move which is very nice one pretty standard pretty standard uh, um tactical shot on the um, on the dragon so he was not expecting that which is good so really you really playing that that's interesting what you're gonna do now you really playing that that's interesting now i'm attacking the queen and also attacking the pawn and also attacking the knight and you cannot play this because of the bishop so if you want yeah you have to go all the way back and now i think you have to capture with the pawn otherwise you lose the game immediately, instantly. You have to capture with a pawn. No, no, this loses immediately. This loses the game immediately. All right, so now you're attacking there. Oh, you're gonna bring, bring the pieces. I'm not worried about that. Not at all. Okay, I'm not exchanging there. Okay, so um, let's exchange. Yeah, 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 let's exchange it all. Yeah, let's exchange it all. That's what I want to do. I want to exchange it all. You will play queen a5, I'm pretty sure. And then... And then I take the rook. And then I take the rook. That's what I would do. Against queen a5, I take your rook. And if you play something else, like this, threatening checkmate, how do I defend that? b4, very brave. I think b4. b4, rook d4. Yeah, a brave move. Let's play a brave move here. Yeah, let's, let's do it bravely. We are, we are brave players, let's play this way. I can even play b5, but you know, I'm a brave player, I wanna play like that. Yeah. And now maybe bishop c4, I don't know. Because I'm two pawns advantage, so I can give one pawn back, like playing this, he's gonna take. And I take that, but, but the problem is he's gonna win a piece here. So we don't wanna allow that. So maybe I gotta push a four, a five or something like that. Maybe g4, maybe h4, I don't know. Yeah, maybe h4, let's just play simple chess here and just play something very quick here and see what happens. Because the position seems to be really well controlled. So I don't have to make up anything here. I'm not solving any problems. I just cannot, should not create any one for me. So I'm, I'm thinking about playing g4, then f4, f5. Okay, I'm playing e5 then. So okay, just want to expose your king a little bit. And possibly g4 is coming anyway. All right, so here we gotta take. All right, so um, this one is nice. It's kind of risky, you know, this. We do some exchanges, but I still don't have to do it. You know, I can simply play like this. So now I do have this passed pawn. And now I can play this. And I see what he's trying to do. He wants to capture here the defender of this pawn. But no, you're okay. That was a good move. That was a good move. 
but it was good. So you want to win my queen. You want to pick up my queen. This move is annoying. How do I react to that? It's going to be tough, guys. It's going to be tough. He, he went. He's going to play this now. And this is not going to be easy. That's what I tell you guys. Not going to be easy. Yeah, he's fighting. Bishop f5 also good. All right, so you want to attack that pawn. So if king b2, rook c8. Yeah, interesting. Tough, tough, tough. So, um, wow, what to do? Rook a4. This just this doesn't seem the right choice. So maybe I gotta go here and allow him to enter. And yeah, he's gonna pick up another a pawn there. But then, okay, then we do have a problem. Wow, 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 wow. I don't know what to do. Maybe this one. I don't know what to do. And I'm getting into time trouble, but at least I defended this pawn. And uh, his queen cannot invade. Let's try this. But I, I'm getting a little bit worried. About this. Especially against the queen e3, that's what I was going to say. Then I don't know what to do. Should I push the pawn? I think so, huh? Well, maybe I gotta defend here. Yeah, I think I have to defend, but then my king is a little bit exposed because of this. But as long as my queen and pawn are protecting there, I'm fine. But okay, I'm running a long time. And now his rook is coming for the attack. Like, I have to play this. He can play a move like this. For example, and he should be winning, I guess. Wow, is that really? Ooh, really? Yes, he wins the game on the spot with this move. I have to play this and sacrifice the exchange. I'm kind of forced to play that. It's like the only move. Very nice position. Very nice position, right? because if I play this, then he takes here. It's also possible, but I think this one is more direct. This one is nice, but I think the other one was stronger. Okay, so we are not allowing that, and I don't know about this move because I win at tempo. Now this bishop is under attack, but okay, he can try to do like this. But now I push the pawn, and I don't know if he can do something about this. Maybe he takes here. I don't know. Okay, simply go away. Yeah, I think it worked. So, um, so just check and push. No, I just push. I think I just push, so he has to... I mean, there's no defense, right? Yeah, yeah, good game, good game. It was a tough one. So he reacted, and 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 then things were pretty uh, tough. So he wants a rematch. Let's go for that, of course. So oh, so uh, you're a London system player. Let's go. Let's play against this London. I don't know about this variation, but okay, let's try. Hmm. You wanna you want the pawn? Take the pawn. It's all yours. You choose any one of them. Any of any of those pawns are yours. Yes. Really, dude? Are you sure? You sure about that? This is going to be interesting.
This is gonna be an interesting game. You gonna castle? No, I don't believe it. This is just insane if you castle. I think at least bishop c4 here, but castling is just insane. Bishop c4 is good. No, I mean, not this one, because now... No, 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 not this one. Because now you're in trouble. Yeah, what you gonna do? No, we're attacking the queen. So, okay. So now we're attacking the queen again. Oh, you got bishop takes f7, followed by queen takes knight. Hmm. Nice. So, can't I just do this instead? And then play queen d7, king g2. I do like this move, but I need to know what to play against this. It's going to take here, but then I think his position is poor after this. Yeah, I, I want to see that coming. I, I want to see what... if I, I don't think it's good. I think we'll have a good position after this. But I didn't calculate the knight, knight lines. Like knight g5 now, I didn't calculate, but I think it, I'm safe. Well, this line is not good. Yeah, we're gonna check. I think he should have given me check with the knight, so I think I have to capture now the knight. Alright, so we can do whatever we want with his king now. I can go here and repeat a little bit. I can go like this and threaten to checkmate. He would try to pin my, my rook, but he can't. He would do like this. Hmm. Yeah, he can play the spawn push, which is a little bit annoying. So I can, of course, take, but why would I do it? It's not threatening anything, but this one is. After this pawn push, I don't have anything, so I think it's better to play like this, because I can play this first, and only then this, so there's no pawn push. Makes sense. It makes a lot of sense. No, dude, I won't allow you to play this way. So first this one. So I'm threatening this, but I don't want queen g5. Okay. All right, so let's do it again a little bit. And now this. So you take the pawn, I go rook d7. Yes, yeah, beautiful. He's getting mated. Nice. So now his queen is under attack and I'm at three pawns down. It's really nice to show that material is just uh, irrelevant. So um, this move was great. This move was great. This move was great. I cannot exchange at this point. So I gotta play this. And then he, he this move was great. I don't know about the game anymore. I don't know about the game anymore. So, yeah, he's gonna play rookie one. He's gonna play rookie one. I, I have the draw if I want, but actually, actually, I don't know if I have the draw. He's gonna play rookie one. Okay, and I'm low on time. It's not good. It's not good at all. So I'm gonna play like this, 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 and I'll be fine, but problem is I probably have to draw this because I'm worth some time, three pounds down, so let's just draw this. I don't know if I'll be able to draw actually, but I'll try. Mm. 
I'm gonna try. This was better. This was better because now he's got some check here. Okay, then I play here. Yeah, all right, let's try this. I'm surviving. Maybe, well, this, I don't know about this move. He's giving back some material so he can avoid the draw, I think. King f6, I don't know. King g8, I don't know. It doesn't solve anything. King f6 seems good, but King g6 seems the best. He's gonna play rook here, so that, that's why he played this. So that's why he played this. So how about playing here and there? Good enough? Let's try. It's going to exchange, but I have an attack on F2. Yeah, it's not easy for him to decide here what to do. All right, this one is good. It's gonna be tough. That's all I, that's all I say, it's gonna be tough. He's two pawns up. And I still, I'm not being able to punish him. Of course, I'm threatening him. Queen takes rook, but he's going to exchange and play king g2 probably, and then knight, queen checks. So I'm, I'm gonna try to do all the checks, you know. That's what I'm trying to do, but now the rook is coming for the attack as well. So I think he lost. Oh, I'm still pinned, I'm still pinned. I'm still pinned, that's too bad. So now he has to find a perpetual. Okay. So he's probably giving me perpetual checks. Otherwise he will get mated. If you want to draw, I take it. You're two pawns up. But I'm giving you mate. You're gonna play h5, right? Because you're a brave guy. Because you're a brave guy. That's also good. See what happens. Queen b3. Oh, there. Nice shot. Nice shot. Um, okay. Okay. Twenty two seconds. Good move. Draw. No draw, play on, <laughs> time out. Okay, he got me. Let's go for the last one if he accepts it. Yeah, he accepted, so 1-1. One, one. Let's go seceding again, 1-1. One, one. You never played in either form? Okay. So he's a dragon player, always. But he's not gonna fall for the same trick again. That's the bad news for me. He's not falling for the same trick twice. Right, that's it. Not falling twice. Or is he? Or 
is he? So now I'm threatening to win the... He's, he's gotta play like... Queen d8 again. And then again we go for this. Oh, now you learned something. So... I don't know about that. It's too dangerous. So let's keep... He's gonna push the pawn, right? I don't want to go that. Bishop a7? No. I don't want to play that. So what should I play here? Bishop c3 and then bishop b4. Yeah. Yeah, it could work. Rook c6 seems good. Seems fine. So this bishop is going to be really good at c3. I'm trying to leave it there. This move is interesting, but um, it doesn't work. I mean, he cannot capture here because I'm capturing here first. So let's see what happens. Oh, he doesn't have any check. So let's try this position here. All right. So I guess we need to try to exchange. Yeah, queen c7. He's gonna play queen c7. Queen e5. Okay, rook d4. No, we don't want to play rook d4. So it seems under control here, but he's gonna play what? a5 here. I don't know. So maybe we want to play bishop d4. So, but I don't know. I'm not sure about that. Um, there is no such a thing, so maybe we should get the queen out of here, maybe here. Maybe here it makes sense. It makes a lot of sense, this move, because I take my queen out of those rook columns and I put a strong pressure there and maybe I'm gonna play g5. It puts, yes, it makes a lot of sense. It's very risky. Sometimes we don't want to put them. But in this case, which is such a strong attack, unless he wants to play something like this in the future, then it could work. So I need to take care of that. He's coming for the sacrifices. He's coming for the sacrifices. All right. Well, this is going to get interesting now. Let's see. What we're gonna what do you what do you play against this? You're gonna check me here, right? And you're gonna sacrifice the exchange for a very strong attack. So what are you threatening here? You're threatening to capture, right? So that's your threat. So I can play king c1 if I want, or maybe queen a1, king a1. But then rook a6, a3. No, rook a6 you cannot play, so let's do it. See what's gonna happen. So now I'm threatening bishop a5. It's not working now on anything like that because I take the queen. But by doing that, I have this dangerous that maybe it's not worth that. And he's gonna do he's gonna play something to to um so that I want to play that and he's gonna sacrifice the exchange, and so I'm not gonna do that. I'm playing g5 instead first. And only after closing this diagonal, then I do that. That's my plan. That's how it will be. So you cannot play rook e6. Maybe you want to play rook d8. Here you cannot. Rook d6, you cannot. Sorry about that. You're kind of stuck. And g5 is coming. So you better play h6, I'll play h4. So it doesn't seem to have any dragon sacrifices here. I don't know. Maybe he has, maybe, maybe he's got some stuff in the pocket. Yeah, he wants to sacrifice now, it's his next move. Now it's written in the stars that he will play this next move for sure. And then keep with that. So, um, yeah, I cannot allow that, or maybe I can. What I have to do is keep pushing my pieces or what? Maybe not allowing that, maybe playing this 
for a while and postponing maybe this. Yeah, I don't know. It's tough, you know, it's tough. What if I play here? Then I don't have this attack anymore. It is tough. So maybe I gotta play this and double the rooks. Why don't I play this? Check. And then take here. It's not time yet. But maybe after I double the rooks, I can sacrifice the queen. Does it make sense? I think it does. Bishop c4 you're gonna play. You're gonna play bishop c4, so it may be better here. Let's see what's gonna happen. I don't know. I'm, I'm a little bit scared, you know, but... I'm going for a beautiful sacrifice. But the problem is this is defended, so this is not going to work. So I'm preparing for a sacrifice that is not playable at this point. Come on, guys, this is tough. I don't know about the move I just played. It doesn't seem the right way to go. But maybe it can work. If I play rook there, yeah, I, I knew it was coming. I knew, I knew, I knew, I knew. Okay. So check. He's gonna put his bishop back. And then I take with the pawn. I can take with the queen here, rook c6, queen, queen d3, but then his bishop is becoming super powerful. I think I gotta play this. I might regret, but let's see what happens. All right, so um, h4, h5, I don't think it's, I, don't, I have time for that. He's playing bishop here. So maybe it's time for something like h4, g5, just before it's too late. When he plays there, I can play here. Let's see what happens. I got 22 seconds. Forget about it. He's just playing very well. Just forget about it. Yeah, I forgot completely about my clocks. Now he's getting his, probably he's getting his victory. What a tough player. What a tough player. What a tough one. So I have to play rook b1 and then g5 and try to exchange everything, but you know, I don't know. If he plays queen here, I go back. But then he is going to the other side. I think I'm screwed up. Okay, I don't know what's that. So I feel like I have to play this because I don't have time. And maybe I can draw. I don't know if I can draw, but I will try to. Okay. Oh, come on. Just make the move. Okay. So actually he's forced to exchange here. Oh, this is made. I didn't see it. Was there any? Was there any? Was there any exit for that? Oh, I was already locked. Rook d4 was the only move. Nice, nice, nice. Well done, well done. And let's see if we do have time for another one. No, I think it's okay for today. Let's just abort this one. And uh, that's it. That's it. All right, guys. So this is it for today's video. Nice games against. Uh, it's not regular. No, bit dredge. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for your audience and see you next time.